Hey guys, I'm trying to pick out a new intro to replace the one we've got now. Pick your favorite, hit submit. I really appreciate it. Okay guys, so I've got an old Acer Chromebook. It's actually the one that I put a screen on in the previous video. Of course, my son uses it for videos and of course it doesn't play in VLC for Chromebooks. It's just awful and has never worked for me if it works for you then that is awesome but it has never worked for me as you can see right here it's a dot mkv and we get nothing it won't play and i've seen a lot of people post even though they converted it, that it still wouldn't play. But I'm going to jump onto the screen on laptop and show you how to convert this. Okay, so we're on the screen of Windows laptop. What we're going to do is we're going to open up VLC. And we're going to go to Media. We're going to go down here to convert slash save. We're going to add our file. Go ahead and hit that right there. And what we're wanting to do is convert it to 264 plus mp3 because what it is right now is 265 and for some reason they made it to where the chrome the player in chrome uh, chromebook will not play 265 but it will play uh, 264 mp4s so, there we go. And then, we're just going to go right down here. Select where we want it to come out at. I'll put, go to our documents. And we're going to hit start. And then what it's going to do is the uh, time is going to go through down here until it's done which can take quite a bit of time it's not just going to play through from there to 21 minutes it's going to actually take quite a bit of time depending on the speed of your processor um, but when it's done it'll just uh, close out so it's completed and we will have our file and I'll show you that playing on the Chromebook in just one second Okay, so we've converted our video. You can see now that it's MP4 and it's gone from 265 to 264. Um, uh, go ahead and double click on that. Can't really play too much of this. I guess the audio is working just fine too. And that's how you do it. No problem. Now you can convert your movies, have them play on Chromebook, and there you go. I would still rather have a Windows machine any day of the week or Linux, but you work with what you got. I'll see y'all next time. I hope this was helpful. Uh, check for links in the description. Thank you.